Hello everyone, in the previous video we explained how to append or insert data from a new table to an old table using append query when we have one primary key column. But today we have a table which we don't have one primary key column as we cannot depend on one column as a primary key because they contains duplicate values. In our case, we depend on two columns to make a primary key. A primary key that is made up of two or more columns is called composite primary key. So the previous append query will not be accurate and will make duplicate records. So let's see how to create append query for a composite primary key table. So we have two tables. One is called employee all data and it contains these columns and we depend on EEID and full name as a primary key and we have the new data we want to insert those data which are not available in the old data table. So let me close these tables and now I go to the create tab and then create query design. Click it and it asks you to add the tables. I will add both tables. Click add and close. This is my new table and this is my old table. The first step is adding all the fields to the fields area. The second step is creating a left join link between these two tables. So I will select EEID and drag it and drop it on EEID on the old data table and then double click on the link and then choose the second selection which tells include all records from the new data table from the left table click ok and as you see we have an arrow pointing to the old data same way we do for the full name as well so drag and drop it on the full name and then double click on the line and then choose include all records from the new data table click ok now we have created the left join now let's click on the append icon and as you see it says the table name the table name is the destination table the table which we want to insert data into it in our case is our employee old data so click the drop down list and then select employee old data and click ok it will appear down here in the second column we choose inside the table field we choose the old data table and from the field name we choose either eeid or a full name so i will choose one of the eeid and as you see eeid will appear here we have to delete this one the last step is writing the criteria which is very simple we just write where EEID is null and this means append these fields where EEID is null which means insert rows only when EEID is not available or it is not there so let's run the query and it says you are about to append 16 rows click yes and then open the old data table as you see, all the new records have been added without making any duplicates. Now, if you want to show the SQL code, right click and then click on SQL view. You see, insert into employee all data, select from the new data these fields, and we have two left joins, and where condition is where the EEID is null from the old data. So without writing this complicated SQL code, we were able to we were able to create the append query in easy way. I hope this video was useful for everybody and see you in my next video.